It's my town, least I can do. Yo, Ray, don't think I'll forget that, man. Come on, my people will like you, huh? You got the right fare. Too many motherfuckers think all you gotta do is jump bad and wear the right colors. Nah, business is a business. You feel me? You gotta be in it with the right people. Yeah, I can see you fitting right in in the state seat. There you are. Yeah. I've been waiting for you, you a single guy. Stand seat. back. Stand back. You crazy? This is icing on the fucking cake. Some nasty ass shit you got going on. Remind me not to fuck with you. Alright, so listen. I'm going back in a week or so. Alright? I'll tell my boys, I got the man. Alright? They'll want to start slow. I'm guessing they can move as much product as you can ship. But this could be huge, man. These boys got some big ideas, too. I'm talking all the legit shit their money goes into. Gotta go somewhere. You feel me? And the feds back home are really cracking down. Brothers might be looking for a little offshore stash. Yeah. And the man who set that up kept it safe. Yeah, he'd have a whole river of green to deal with. You feel me? Well, I could swing that for you. I still got contacts stateside who could set up the other side of things. Mm-hmm, hell yeah. Yo, you ever work in movies, wait? Nah, too much bullshit. I mean, look at Sonny Walk. Nah, man. Come on, that's what's good about it. Everybody's a fucking moron. You come in with muscle and money, and you too can call the shots. You got a point. Man, I really appreciate it. Really. It's real cool to meet you. We'll see you around. Yeah, for sure. Hopefully first night of many. Well then. Looks like this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. <laughs> Alright, man. Take care.
I found one of your statues. The rooster? Good, good. Thank you for the statue. It seems as though they're all finding their way back to me now. Perhaps that was their destiny from the start. What does that make me? Oh, I have no doubt your return to Hong Kong will affect many destinies. Not least your own. Yeah? Surely. That's why you came in the first place. Maybe I just wanted to move back. Maybe. And maybe I decided to break my own rule and train a known triad for no reason whatsoever. But I think we both know different. What would you like to learn?
<laughs> I don't mind you fucking her is one of the perks, but she has to understand the consequences if she disappoints me. Are we clear? Of course, Sonny. You're not getting attached, are you? A man of your caliber? You don't need to worry about that. I hope not. Way, come in, have a drink. You ever fuck some famous pussy, Way? Not yet. Maybe one day. <laughs> it's a trip, man, let me tell you. You drive by one of those billboards the size of a building, and you tell yourself, I'm going to her place, bend her over the table, and mmm, and then you do it. There's no other feeling like it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, speaking of stars, I need to go pick up Vivian. Let Wei do it. You and I have more business to discuss. How about it, Wei? Think you can handle a smoking hot starlet for the day? Uh, sure. I you know, as long as Ricky doesn't think I'm moving in on his territory. Nah, no, of course not. Here, take my car. <laughs> you take good care of my little starlet. Go ahead and fuck her if you want. Just don't damage the goods. my boyfriend? Why do I have to put up with this? No, Vivi. It's not wrong. And you put up with it because Ricky loves you. But... But what? Since your boyfriend isn't driving, I get to sit in front. <laughs> Why are the bad ones always so good looking? I'm Sandra. What's your name again? It's Way. Ricky talks about him a lot. Oh, all nice things, I'm sure. And you're here to basically do whatever we want? Uh, something like that. What do you have in mind? Hmm. Do you have steady hands at high speeds? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I can provide references if you like. Um, are you trying to talk him into one of those street races you always go on about? 